Hey guys, how are y'all doing today? Okay, I'm going to show you how to record your voice, do an audio recording using QuickTime. It's very simple and it's totally free. So all you have to do is go into your desktop. You can either use uh, Finder or Spotlight and just look for QuickTime Player. It should be on every single Mac computer. And once you're there, just go up to File and you will see new audio recording so you click that and you will have an option to pick your microphone now you can also uh, click either high or maximum quality I always leave it on high and it seems to work extremely well but I guess it really depends on your system so you can try either one of these uh, whatever works better for you but on my system high is just fine and just remember to pick the microphone that you're using now some webcams have a microphone built in like the webcam C920 that I have but I also have a Rode NT1 mic and I run it through a mixer so I use a USB audio codec uh, but whatever microphone you're using just be sure and pick it be sure and keep your volume down all the way here because this is not uh, a volume uh, input this is for output so you would be getting feedback if you were to turn this up and then you would just click and it will start recording and when you're done just click it again and there you go it is totally finished um, now to save it just go up the file and click save or you can click export uh, and of course you'll see since it is audio it will say audio only uh, and you just name it and pick where you want it to be saved at and I usually save everything to my desktop and then I can move it to wherever I want to on my computer if I want to move it to a music folder uh, it doesn't really matter uh, so that's how easy it is and the quality is very very good then if you want to tweak it you can import it into a program like audacity that's totally free or even GarageBand if you want to uh, to do any further tweaking like putting effects in or anything else you'd like to do okay so thank you so much for watching another easy apple tutorials video and we hope that you will subscribe and you will keep watching and we're gonna just go through all the simple stuff that Mac has to offer that most of y'all may already know how to use but I didn't know how to use them until I watched tutorial videos so thanks again and slap a like on this video bye bye